In Japan, a powerful earthquake with a magnitude of 7.6 struck at around 16.10 local time on Monday, leading to widespread impact. Reports confirm four fatalities, dozens injured, and an unknown number trapped beneath the rubble. About 60 tremors followed the initial quake. Baldwin Chia, a holidaymaker, described the terrifying moment when his hotel room shook, expressing concern about avalanches. Andy Clark shared his experience in Toyama, describing a scary afternoon and evening, grabbing the seawall for stability. Jeffrey Hall in Yokohama felt tremors for about two minutes, emphasizing the quake's severity. Major highways closed, power outages affected over 36,000 households, and landslides ripped apart expressways. Former BBC correspondent Rupert Wingfield Hayes reported on a landslide tearing apart the main expressway. Video footage from Uchinada showed rippled and cracked roads, while damage to the Onohiyoshi Shrine in Kanazawa was evident. Initially, a major tsunami warning was issued, but it was later downgraded as waves hitting the Sea of Japan coast were minimal. Japan, located in the Pacific Ring of Fire, faces constant seismic threats. Despite several nuclear plants in affected areas, authorities assure no risk of radioactivity leaking. The earthquake brought back memories of the devastating 2011 event that triggered a tsunami, resulting in significant loss of life and a nuclear meltdown at the Fukushima power plant. The full extent of the damage remains unclear, but Japan, equipped with a sophisticated tsunami warning system, faces the aftermath of this latest seismic event.